All right, but Natalie, how about we start uh, with a special location this morning that is now open in Ybor City. It's the it's the, the Columbia Restaurant's new Sicilian restaurant, Casa Santo Stefano. And uh, what a treat to be linking in with them this morning virtually. Again, they are doing some amazing things. They're cooking up some amazing things that's truly unique here in the Bay Area. Oh, it is the new hotspot in Ybor for sure. We're so lucky to be joined by the executive chef Alessio Celery, how did I say that? You say it much better. Perfect, buongiorno. Buongiorno, buongiorno. Welcome to the blend. Alessio, I cannot wait to dive in on menu items, but uh, I'm first gonna bug the gentleman that's holding the camera. I think our friend Jeff is there. Jeff, we gotta talk background yeah. though. I gotta be honest, this is one of the Gone Smart restaurants and we know them, we love them in the Bay Area. Why did Richard decide to go ahead and, and go in a Sicilian direction there in Ebor? Sure. Uh, good morning, by the way. Um, good morning. <laughs> Richard really loves to tell stories through his food. So the Columbia tells the story of Tampa, Yulele, goody goody, everything has a little piece of Tampa's food history. This was really an homage to the 60% of, Sil of Sicilians who came from two villages in Sicily, Santo Stefano Kiskina and Alessandro della Roca. And they flooded this area in the late 1800s and early 1900s and brought all of their food traditions with them. They started businesses. Uh, the building that we're in was built in 1925 as a macaroni factory by the Ferlita family. And Richard has always loved this building. And the Sunday suppers he grew up with uh, going next door to Sicilian families' houses, he wanted to make sort of a, a warm, inviting, elevated form of those Sunday suppers. So that's what we have at, at Casa Santo Stefano doing lunch and dinner. And then we also have the rooftop Santos Drinkeria from 5 to 11 every night where you hang out, you have some sandwiches, you have some drinks, you smoke a cigar. It's just a, a totally unique experience deep in the heart of Ybor City. Uh, that was literally the word I was going to use. Yes. It's so unique to have this and everything from the ingredients that you guys are using, which we'll send it over to the chef now to make sure that he has some time uh, to prepare what he is making. Jeff. <laughs> but chef, talk about that. What are you cooking for us this morning? And the ingredients literally come from Sicily as well. A lot of them, whatever you can get your hands on. Yes. Well, today we're going to uh, feature our uh, porchetta panino, which is our sandwich made with our Sicilian mucculetto bread that we make in the house. And uh, we're going to stuff it with uh, our homemade porchetta. <clears throat> the porchetta is uh, known all over Italy. It's basically pork belly and pork loin rolled with fresh garlic, um, green onions, fennel seeds, salt and pepper. These are some cracklings that we're gonna use to top our sandwich. Wow. I don't think I've seen anything like this before, yeah. Kyle. Alessia, so as you are cutting this up right now and preparing a sandwich, that I think sandwiches, I think lunch, you are able to offer lunch now. I mean, the restaurant's only been opened since the end of November, and here you are already diving into the lunch menu, right? Yes, we are very excited. And finally, we have uh, we can have our uh, um, tamponiers enjoying our Sicilian food. So porchetta is well known um, as a uh, an Italian dish, um, very homespun, but done well. It's absolutely irresistible with this moist pork, uh, grilled and uh, heated up just a little bit to go on the sandwich. Nice. Alessia, what are some of the other things that you can indulge in on your menu while we're watching this well, cooked we, up? What are some of your favorites? We really go from uh, house-made sausage, house-made pasta, gelato, cannoli, Sicilian castata. We have it uh, of all kinds. Oh, I would love that. Man, you are making me hungry yeah. right now. We just want a very light sear and we're ready to go. We want to keep it nice and moist. Nice. So let's talk. Lunch menu different than the dinner menu, or can you get favorites at the at this new hot spot any time of the day? So we have lunch versions of our dinner menu, and then we also offer these sandwiches, the panino and uh, cardachata, that are these stuffed bread sandwiches. And he's going to continue to make his sandwich. Um, that uh, you can have those at lunch or upstairs at night in the drinkeria. But, you know, we make our own ravioli. We make our own lasagna. Oh, 
Nothing wow. better. Nothing better than handmade, homemade pasta. Oh, yeah. You can't beat that. And then the pasta that we import, the hard pastas, we asked the Sicilians when we did our research, and they're like, we don't make hard pastas. We buy them. And so we buy them direct from Sicily. And even the grain that they use is, spe is special because it has a different flavor than what you buy here in the United States. Wow. What's the, do you need reservations right now? What's mm -hmm. the best way to make sure you can get a, a seat? And I know you're doing, um, you know, pick up, you know, carry out as well. We are. We're doing carry out uh, for people who want to do uh, curbside takeout. We have a curbside takeout lane. But we also, uh, you know, we do accept reservations. Walk-ins are welcome. Reservations as, at any restaurant are harder to get on the, uh, on the weekends than they are during the week. But, um, you know, we encourage it just so you know that you have a place. But absolutely, you can walk in and just stuff yourself silly and enjoy all these <laughs> brilliant flavors. Of <laughs> I love that. Stuff yourself silly. Well, we talked about the unique vibe and, of course, yeah. the unique experience. Jeff, it was a unique experience getting you to join us today. Thank you for, for weighing in. And Alessio, wonderful to meet you. Oh, it really was my pleasure. Thank you for having me. Oh, man. Who's hungry, Carly? We I know. Let's <laughs> go eat. Go eat. We've got a show. Let's take that. <laughs> oh. You guys have lunch sometime. I know, I know. Yeah. Gentlemen, thank you so much. We look forward to checking in with you guys soon, okay? Thank you very much for having us. Woo! All right. Lunch is served. And <laughs> stay right there. We, of course, will be right back.